Here we go. Okay. So I'll let you verify the, the yeah. serial numbers. Release the there, there we go. Uh, if you can please submit in writing a request that you want to release to the firearms. So you're requesting the firearms back, right? Yeah. This I firearms regarding this case? Uh-huh. Okay. You submitted to me a request regarding it sometime? Yeah. Okay. Let me look it up real quick. Okay. Okay. Hey, how are you? Sir? Good, how are you? Good, good. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Let me, uh, you know what? I'll look it up. And if I need for you to write something again, I'll that one? I will. Okay. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, my chain. Hasta ahorita. Lo vemos. Hello, man. Yes. You sign in, please. Sure. How are you, man? I'm just fine, thank you. The date. And then the time, it's 1.22. Uh, really? Then your signature. So mm. for... Yeah, you can do so. Who am I here to see? Who are you here to see? Who, who, who am I here to see? I don't know. You said Trooper Aguilar? Oh, Aguilar, okay. okay. Yeah. If we didn't need you to write something. Okay, okay. Okay. Is that it? Yes. Um, Go ahead and take it. All right, thank you. Yes. Hello, sir. How are you? Nice to meet you. Let's go in this office right here. Sure, okay. You can follow me. Thank you. You can take a seat on this side. Thank you, sir. You're here to pick up your weapons, correct? Yes, sir. It was a handgun and a uh, rifle. Rifle, yes, sir. Okay. District Attorney's Office. Got it. So we'll have that on file. Um, I'm just going to ask you to verify the serial numbers and just to sign off on a okay. document, just uh, acknowledging the return. So it's a very simple form. It has a date when it was seized, your name. Uh, the reporting officer was uh, Trooper Jose Aguilar. I'm the corporal that handles the entrusted property. Okay. Um, and this is, has the information for the office. And it has a description of the weapons along with the serial numbers accordingly. And as you can see, uh, this is very simple. I, Ismael Rincon, mm -hmm. received the described items here and from Corporal Urieta on, I left the dates and the time pending because we're gonna do that right now. Okay. And it'll just require your signature. And your address. So, uh, did you verify the, the you serial have, numbers? You have the original uh, inventory form. You I do. Have. Just to compare the, uh, the serial yes, numbers. Let me verify it's this one. Yes. So it'll show the items that were seized.
Oh, does it have a serial number here? Yes, sir. It's going to be on it? right next to Oh, okay, okay. J H S A A. Okay. And then sub 2000. F F C four. Okay. Okay. Sure. I'll let you go. Okay. That's correct? Yep. You can verify this one? Where is it at? Might be on this side or the other side. I'm not sure. Can you see it there or you use flashlight? That probably makes it worse. Oh, yeah, this one. Uh, PC. Okay. So it's correct? Yes. Alrighty. Let me add the time and date. So the date is April 29, 2024. Time is 1.27 p.m. If you can just add your signature, please, okay. and your address. Uh, is the ammo, is that going to be separate? The what, I'm sorry? The ammo. The ammunition, sir, uh, as far as us storing it, we don't store it. Um, so that was probably sent out for destruction, the ammo. Okay. Okay. You want to uh, receive compensation for that? I don't know, sir. Uh, uh, let me see what was seized exactly. Okay. It doesn't list the ammo being seized. Okay. I would have to backtrack and verify. Um, but the magazines are there, as you can see. They're empty, right? Yes, they are. On this one, they're both empty. Oh. So, So the trooper, the troopers are supposed to, when they seize a weapon, mm -hmm. they're supposed to leave the ammo in the uh, in the vehicle. That doesn't come with us. We, the only thing we seize is the, the actual weapon. Okay. Uh, as far as figuring out if the ammo was there or not, I would have to go back and review that video. Yeah. I would have to find it. That one. Now, if the ammo did come with us by mistake, because it happens sometimes, sometimes the troopers caught up there and they forget to leave the ammo in the, okay. in the vehicle. If that is the case, uh, I mean, I, we, we still get the ammo and we put it aside, okay. put it in a separate bag, uh, and, and we just pretty much just set it out for destruction because okay. we we're not supposed to submit those or keep them in, in our right. property. Okay. So as far as that, I mean, if, right. if, if you really, really need me to check on that, I mean, I would have to do all this backtrack and, and, and try right. to find out what exactly happened with that ammo. Um, oh, I know. We don't compensate for the ammo, but like I said, if you really, really need me to check, so then I'll check. Um, I would is just is that just like policy or, or? For what, sir? Like to keep the ammo or not, not return it or? The thing is, we're not supposed to keep it. All right. We're not supposed to keep it. Uh, you, go, you follow policy or something like that? Yeah, or? yeah, but it, in the heat of the moment, sometimes the troopers caught up with all the paperwork, right, the arrest, right. whatever's going on, okay. and we'll verify. Oh, um, I just need to find the video okay. and I need to see how much ammo was in them exactly that one. Um, and we'll that just one. take it from there. Porque, I mean, I'm going to be honest with you, that's a Fifth Amendment violation. What, if, what, if, you what don't, you, if you don't compensate, 
me for the property that was seized for me. That, we'll give you your ammo. I, if it's there, it's okay, there. Okay, that one. Um, it's just, I mean, I have to find out how much was in, in, that one. in, All right. the, in the weapons. So you want me, uh, I can still sign off and then we can yeah, uh, I mean, figure I'll, out that I'll later, just, right? I'll just hand off the ammo. All right, it, that one. That's no problem. Um, is that okay? Or you need CD and all that. No, what I'm sorry. You need everything like the CD, yeah, yeah, zip code. Is that okay? Or? Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Um, I'll make a copy and give you a copy of this. Okay. And also, if you can sign, well, let me just verify. I don't think it requires a signature. But... This is just the chain of custody. This stays with me. Are you related to the other trooper, Urieta? Yeah, he's my brother. Oh, okay, okay. He's the one that arrested me now, the, the other time? For the I warrant? So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You want me to put the spike strip under me? Yeah. Mr. Rincon, at this point, you're going to be placed under arrest for uh, an active warrant that you have out of uh, Polk County for an, uh, engaging in criminal activity. Yeah. Open the door. If not, we're going to have to open up the door and get you down. Okay, okay. So that, I, I was about to tell you, um, I do need approval ID. Do you have an identification? Uh, yeah, in my car. You want to go grab it? Sure. Uh, I'll wait for you. You want a photo or no? You want to make a copy of the... I need that. Hold on. Let me go get it. Yeah. So you need this, right? Do you have it already? I have that. Okay. Right. All right. Sorry. Come in, sir. Go ahead. Hello. How's it going, sir? Hello, sir. How are you doing? Okay. It's my little gun. Good it's mine. You good? Yeah. I'll catch up with you mm -hmm. a bit. All right, sir. Did you get your ID? Oh, yeah. sorry. All right, good. Mr. Rincon. And no issues since the date of uh, when you received the disposition from the district attorney, correct? Like with no that case? arrest or oh yeah i have another arrest pending but you know, okay it's still pending no convictions no okay this is fine Yeah, that, that warrant from uh, from when your brother arrested me for, for that warrant, that got dismissed already. Yeah. Okay. Almost like... Did they close the case? Yeah, they closed it. Okay. Yes, sir, I do, sir. So everything's good on the on the returns. And... This is just for the chain of custody. If you can just enter your information, sir. Basically, it's same that it's going back to you. You can just enter your name, the date, and the time, please, on both. And it's for, for I mean, if you need to verify, it's gonna be for each weapon individually. Okay. It's gonna be for each serial number. It's gotcha. just for, for our records, for the chain of custody. Yes, sir. 4.29. What time? And the time is uh, 1.37 p.m.
I haven't given you your copy, correct? No. Okay. This is your copy. And here are your weapons. The only thing you should record that is gonna be pending. I need to like I need to go literally watch the video. Okay. And see what exactly was was there or if they left it in the vehicle. That one. Este, so just just give me some time on that. I'll check All right. It out. right. Um, it, there was another officer, no? Okay, so inventory. I think. So. Actually, I'm I'm looking at the name. It was it was actually me. I did the inventory. Oh, really? um, yeah, but if I'm not mistaken, when I arrived there, he already had you in his unit. He had yeah, done the seizure. Uh -huh. So when I got there, I, I did the rest of the inventory. Okay. Um, okay. So I need to I need to see what exactly he he got from from the vehicle. Okay. If, okay. Or if he happened to leave him in the vehicle and. I don't know. I need to check on that. The one. Okay, technical bills. Two rifle magazines containing. Okay, I see the ammunition. Lo, lo demás ahí estaba, like the the other magazines and stuff. Okay, yeah, yeah, which is what he noted here. Yeah. Um. Porque estaban en el. Yeah, because one of them is what it's a. Both both of them are nine. Nine mils, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. Do you remember having a specific type of ammunition? Uh, nah, no me acuerdo. No. Do you remember them being lo uh, fully loaded? Yeah, they were fully loaded. Okay. They're, they're always fully loaded. What's the capacity on each one? Uh, oh, the, the este, this is a 31 round. Plus one. So you have 31 plus one? Uh, in el, no, in the rifle, I'm making them 31. 31? Yeah. Yes, the. Uh, eight, eight round. Yes, just give me some time. I'll check up that on one. that. I don't know if you want to leave a call, but I'll call you back. Sure, yeah. Go ahead. Uh Nine, nine, five, six. Nine, five, six, right? Yes. All right, sir. Well, my name is Agustin Durieta. Let's just give me some time. I'll check up on that. All right. And I will figure out um, the deal with the ammo. And, all right, all right. And give you a call back. That one. Good. As far as mm, I'm not familiar, like with college. Like to to leave. Uh huh. Uh, to get back on. No, the, no, no. Like with the rifles and stuff. With the rifle. Um, they won't tell you anything, but I'll tell you what, I'll walk out with you. All right, yeah. Just yeah. in case that nobody gets alarmed or nothing like you that. You want to take it? Um, yeah. I'll help you take it, yeah. Yeah, I think it'll be <laughs> better. Sorry. Do you have the hanging already? Yeah, okay. it's here. All right. You want to take it too? That's fine, we'll walk in. All right. Thank you. You already have your stuff, you already have your copy, right? Yeah, yeah. Your driver's license? Yes. Okay. Yeah, there's two. Thank you, sir. All right, sir. So you All have right. your property, you're good to go? Yeah, yeah. All right, no, thank you, sir. Thank uh, you. you. Be safe.